Hey, good morning, folks. We're doing a garage sale coffee challenge today. I got a vintage Pyrex teapot. I'm just going to use to borrow uh, boil water in there. And bought that at a garage sale for $3. Bought the stove at a garage sale for $10. And I'm going to use a French press I got at a garage sale with some coffee grinds in it. All right, let's get started. See if this thing even works. Oh, here's some. Oh, it does light. Actually, it lights really good. Who knows when the last time this old stove was going. Let that generator heat up. I'm using the fuel that this thing originally came with so this is a coleman 431 oh yeah settled down right away i actually really like this stove so i'm going to take some parts from my other stove and i'm going to restore this one all right on goes the vintage coffee or uh sorry teapot Turn the lever down to run. And we're running away here. All right, water's starting to swirl around in that flameware Pyrex teapot. Never used one before, so that's pretty cool. I'm trying to find a coffee one, but so far they're few and far between. But, uh, We'll just get that heated up. Okay, it looks like we're coming to a boil over there. That should be hot enough. Shut this down. All right, so we got a tin cup, enamel cup. I uh, got that for free from our garage sale. Got our water boiled, and I got a French press here. It's a coffee press before. But I got that French press at a garage sale. Uh, we're gonna use this Sterling brand coffee. Uh, nothing fancy to write home about. Put some grinds in there, I guess. And then uh, take this. We're gonna add our water. I got a good dollop of honey in there already. So I'm just gonna get a spoon. Stir that. Look at the froth. Looks pretty reasonably thick, I guess, for coffee. Then I'm gonna shove this thing on here and just slowly push it down. Like I said, I've never used something like this before, so I'm not really entirely sure what I'm doing. There we go. Stirring my honey. And since my coffee's like 80,000 degrees, put a couple ice cubes in it. That was a pretty good cup of coffee. Could you be a little darker than that? But see you on the next one, folks.